And welcome to your Gold Market Update Charts of the Day for today, the 12th of July 2023. Mike Smith, Senior Analyst here, to lead you around what's happening in markets about midway through the Asian session today. Of course, overnight we saw US equities move higher with more than 3 to 1 advances versus decliners again. Another broad based rally we saw the Russell 2000 and the Dow outperform in terms of the overall indices. We have US CPI tonight with softer number expected. And of course, US earnings season starts at the end of this week, which the market also will have half an eye on at this stage. US futures are near neutral in the Asian session. Asian markets are cautionally high generally in today's trading so far. The Nikkei is underperformed significantly. However, the ASX is at 0.4% with materials and utility sectors outperforming. European futures point to a positive open. The VIX continues to move downwards again. US dollar index dropped overnight to hit a two month low. It's lower again in Asia so far. We're seeing moves higher in gold and copper and oil, all on the back of that USD weakness. Uh, gold is approaching a key 1940 level, where copper sitting around a key 380 level, both important technical landmarks. Bitcoin is holding 30,000 support and sitting mid range at this stage. On the data front, we've already had Japanese PPI out, which has been soft, and the RBNZ. Rate decision, which came in as expected with no change. Got Canadian rate decision later on today, but US CPI is the headline. Also, the US 10-year bond auction may be interesting due to recent decline in bond yields and the pressure that that's put on the US dollar. A couple of charts the corner. Right. If we look at the GB pound Aussie, you can see there we've had real weakness ever since the middle of the US session last night. This has continued in Asia and has breached that 193 level uh, you'll see here and has continued downwards looks as though it may pause at 192.50 but if we breach that we could see a test of 191 in the medium term it's one to watch today for sure we're still interested in yan coal ticket code yal you can see there it's pushed up against this resistance at this at this stage at 476 uh, just keep an eye on that for a potential breach as energy continues to be strong and perhaps worth checking in in the last hour to see where it's sitting. Trade safe and we'll see you again soon. Bye bye for now.